Hi, I'm Dr. David Robinson of the Florida Hospital Cancer Institute. If you are seeking treatment for lung cancer, it is very important for you to understand the anatomy and the treatment options. Your lungs are two spongy organs in your chest. The lung is divided into two lobes or sections, and the right lung has three lobes. When you breathe in, air enters your nose or mouth and passes into your trachea or windpipe. At the carina, the trachea divides into bronchi, then branches into smaller bronchioles. The bronchioles enter into tiny air sacs called alveoli. Here, the oxygen of the air you inhale passes into the bloodstream and carbon dioxide from your body passes out of the bloodstream. The carbon dioxide is expelled from your body when you exhale. Your lungs are encased by pleura, a thin membrane that protects them and helps them slide back and forth as you breathe in and out. Underneath your lungs is the diaphragm, a smooth, thin muscle that helps your lungs expand and contracts as you breathe. Your lungs are connected to a small collection of immune system cells called lymph nodes by way of lymphatic vessels. You have groups of these lymph nodes in your lungs, above your collarbones, and behind your breastbones, as well as in other parts of your body. The lymphatic vessels carry bacteria, cancer cells, and other unhealthy material away from your lungs and other organs in a clear fluid called lymph. Lymph nodes filter this material out of the lymphs. Lung cancers most commonly start in the bronchi, but they can also begin in the trachea, bronchioles, or alveoli. There are several options for managing lung cancer. To find the best one for you, please feel free to contact us.